Good evening. In this video, I'll discuss about logit model in R Studio. Before going through this video, kindly go to introduction part of logit and probit model. I have already explained this concept in separate video. Talking about logit model, I have data set of Swiss lever which includes participation as dependent variable, income, age and other variables are independent variable. I am going to apply logit model on participation and income only. As participation is categorized in two parts and it is dependent variable also, that's why we are going to apply logit model. So here I'm going to save the value of logit model in model one, then equal to GLM, which is general, general linear model, and then dependent variable that is participation on the basis of income, which is independent variable, and then family equal to binomial and link equal to logit and data equal to Swiss lever enter. Now value of general linear model or logit model has been saved in model 1. I write here summary model 1 enter. This is the output of logit model. This value talks about mean, first quartile, median, third quartile and maximum value of deviance residual. Let's talk about the interpretation of this income which is independent variable. Income is significant. It means income obviously affects the chances of participation. So how to interpret in logic model? It can be interpreted that one unit increase in income will increase the chances by minus 0 0.9165 as log odd. Let's explain it in detail. I simply write here exponential and then minus 0 0.9165 this minus 0 0.9165 is nothing but simply this is the coefficient of income and then enter. It means increase in one unit or one rupee in income will increase the chances of participation by 0 0.39. Now, either this model is fit or not. For that, we can talk about the p-value of chi-square. So, how to calculate p-value of chi-square? Simply, I'm going to write here chi is equal to model 1 and then null deviance minus model 1 and symbol of deviance enter. Similarly, we can save the degree of freedom difference by writing model 1 then symbol of dollar and degree of freedom null minus model 1 then we can also write here 
degree of freedom residual enter well talking about p value of chi square we can write here p chi square and then chi and comma degree of freedom difference again comma and low tail f and enter well if you see the value the value is less than five percent hence we can say that this model is fit similarly we can also calculate pseudo r square in linear regression we talk about r square whereas in logit or probit model we talk about pseudo r square for that we can call Baylor Baylor at psych package and then enter and then simply you can write here pseudo r square and model 1 enter these all are different kind of pseudo r square so that is all about logic model in r studio thank you very much